India launched a GSLV carrying Chandrayaan-2 for its inaugural science lander mission on July 22, 2019. But communication was lost at 2.1 kilometers above the lunar surface during landing. The lander Vikram's hard touchdown on September 7, 2019 dashed India's hopes of a successful inaugural lunar landing. The report states that Vikram lander followed a normal path until an altitude of 2.2 kilometers and then deviated at 2.1 kilometers leading to communication loss and mission uncertainty. Deviation was observed between 2.1 kilometers and 0.2 kilometers above the lunar surface. The report suggests vibrations during braking and descent could have caused power cord or antenna disconnection resulting in communication loss. Thruster shutdown or improper firing led to loss of spacecraft control and crash during lunar landing. No spacecraft power was observed during descent leading to computer shutdown, thruster failure and communication cutoff. Limited solar irradiance in moon's south polar region could have contributed to spacecraft's power depletion during Chandrayaan 2. The report suggests considering nuclear thermoelectric generators or radio sort of thermoelectric generators as secondary power sources and backups. Despite the failure of the first lander mission, ISRO has put forth a proposal for another landing demonstration mission called Chandrayaan-3 in collaboration with the Japanese Aerospace Exploration Agency. ISRO will provide the lander while Japan will contribute the launcher and rover for the mission. Chandrayaan-3 will feature additional equipment including a laser doppler velocimeter and night survival technologies to facilitate site sampling exploration. The report insists that landing site selection is a crucial factor in the success of a soft landing mission. Various sites satisfying different conditions were chosen for terrain analysis using high resolution camera data from Chandrayaan-2 orbiter. Based on these criteria, three sites were selected and LS2 was identified as the prime landing site for Chandrayaan-3. It offers better distribution of safe grids within the landing area, providing flexibility for the lander to choose a landing spot. LS2 is located between Manzius U and Bogoslavsky M craters. Piggybacking on a GSLV Mark 3 launcher, Chandrayaan-3 is tentatively scheduled to lift off from Sriharikota on July 12, 2023. It is set to go into an elliptical orbit around the moon before attempting to soft land on the celestial body. Subscribe to the Federal's YouTube page for more news and updates.